dodge, jump, move differently all the time. It helps because they won't be able to read what you're doing as, as... Oh! That was sick. How's it going everyone? Lucian Sword here playing some more Brawlhalla for you guys today as always. I hope you're all having a beautiful day wherever you guys might be. So today we're going to be playing a little bit of Koji. That's right, I haven't played Koji in forever, and I've had lots of people saying that I should play Koji, so today we are playing Koji. I've also had people say that I should make a uh, guide on how to use bow or sword or whatever. Um, I, um, yeah, I don't know about making a guide per se, because honestly, uh, Brawlhalla is the type of game where everybody can have a different play style, you know, there's not like one way to play the game. Uh, though I will say that there are some fundamentals that you should know, and I will go over those in this video. Hopefully, uh, just by watching the video, you'll be able to get some ideas on things that you can do with Koji. Now, I literally have had no practice today with Koji, but that being said, I mean, I am a diamond player, so I should be able to be halfway decent with Koji. And I do know how to play Koji, just, you know, a little bit rusty right now, but... We'll see what we can do, and uh, yeah, hopefully get that win. All right, going against Nash is going to be fun. Nash has really strong moves there. With Sword, your bread and butter is really down light into like any other kind of string. Koji has some pretty interesting moves. I really love the uh, down sig on both the bow and the sword. Ooh, I almost got him with that. The best thing about bow is the range. It will outrange most weapons, including the spear, if I could actually... Nice weapon throw there that he did. Oh man, my music is, is quiet. Every time I like go into a match... If I could hit him once with this down sig, it is over. And it actually hits... Oh my goodness! I was going to say, the down stick actually hits farther than most people realize. Boom. All right. We even it right back up. Baited him on that weapon pickup and punished. All right. Let's try the bow again. Oh, wow. Big boy going for that big punch, aren't you? Careful, buddy. Oh, man. If I would have held that just a moment longer. There you go. See what I mean? That move is actually really easy to hit. It even hits in the air like a little bit, believe it or not. I don't know why. He keeps on going into it, so I kind of just want to keep on holding it. Because I feel like he's going to keep walking into it, you know what I mean? Oh man, this guy is really good! Holy cow, Andromeda. Alright, let's go ahead and bring this back. We gotta win this game. No more Mr. Nice Koji Nash. All right, all right, all right. We gotta kill him. All right, he killed himself. Now, never mind. <laughs> it worked out. I think I'm doing better with the sword than the bow, but I will use whatever I need to. Gotta watch out for that hammer. Recovery, especially. Oh my goodness, Nash. Not like this, I'm still alive. Recovery into his mind. That was an epic finish. GG do GG. I mean, literally, he was doing really good that entire game, but we just survived. Sometimes that's all you got to do is just survive until some crazy play happens, and then you get the win. Well, like I said, I was a little bit rusty with Koji, so we're warming up. Uh, let's go ahead and do this uh, really cool skin. This is called Street Samurai Koji, and uh, let's go esports colors. I really like it on that. But I'm going to give him a different bow. Let's see. 
let's give him the digital sample. That bow looks really cool. And then for the sword, oh guys, I want to I want to show you my new sword if I can find it. I just got this sword skin in the viewership rewards by watching the uh, esports Brawlhalla esports. Where is it? There it is. The Regal Sun Sword. Check that out. Doesn't it look pretty good? Ooh, it looks pretty good when it's like dark like that. Oh, nice. Got the golden hilt. But against Kuwambo. A Magyar with the with the new Jae Young Greatsword skin. I like it. I really I really like this uh, Regal Sun Sword that I got though. I had to watch the live stream for like three days. The Brahalla Esports live stream just to get this sword skin. So let's go ahead and get a win, baby, with our first game with it. See what we can do. Again, my music is messed up. I don't know why the music gets messed up all the time. Uh, note to self, never spot dodge against a great sword user. So far, so good, guys. So far, so good. Oh, yep, got that stock. Let's go. Pretty good sword gameplay. Pretty good, pretty good. Let's go to the bow. See what I can do with Koji's bow. Boop, got him. Oh, I was trying to actually pick the bow back up, but that's all right. I try to go wherever I think they don't. Like, wherever wherever they think I'm, I'm going to go, I purposefully don't go that way. Look at that range on that down sig. I'm telling you guys. Oh my goodness. I committed all the way down on that ground pound and it paid off. Alright, some more bow gameplay maybe. Don't be afraid to throw out those bow neutral airs. They do. Oh my gosh, that great sword. No. Okay, GG. That was a good ground pound. Good edge guard. We got a nice, nice lead here, so. As long as I don't mess it up too bad, we should be able to get this win. Boom. I love Koji down sig on sword because it gets me like halfway across the map. Sometimes it's really useful. Alright, how are we going to kill this guy? Are we going to take him off the ceiling? I think so. It's a tall ceiling, but he seems to be weak against it. Yup, going up. GG dude, GG. Well played. Koji is too good. Alright, let's switch to the other epic skin other than the Shinsekai Koji. Let's do... That's the first epic skin. This one is so good. This is the second one, Michonne. Uh, for colors, I'm not really sure... Wow. Actually, let's go Frozen Forest. I've never, I've never seen Frozen Forest on Michonne before. Such a cool katana. And she has a cool looking bow. It's kind of basic, but it's still cool. It's like a really long bow or something like that. And check it out. She got fire sigs. She's got zombie hands. Oh, going against Thatch. Thatch is, is actually a good legend. He has low defense. That's his only weakness. But the, the cannonballs... The sword side zig that hits twice. Oh my goodness, it's insane. I love this guy's name. It goes with Thatch perfectly. Driftwood, man. Perfect. Perfect. I love that down zig. Oh, I just did it right into his zig that time. Oh man, I did it facing the wrong way and I got punished so hard from that. Dude, I'm still alive somehow. We're not gonna question it. 
We're gonna roll with it, baby! I should have died a while ago, but somehow... He died. And now is where we take the lead, because we are gonna rack up this damage. Uh-oh, that's okay. Oh my goodness, goodbye, Driftwood! Ooh! That gravity cancel neutral sig really set him up for failure because if he hits, he gets a stock, and if he misses, he loses a stock. Notice how when I do that down sig on sword, I put on the cape? I'll try to hold it next time so you can see it. It looks super cool. He dodged everything there. Oh my goodness. Hey, he's using Thatcher 6 to its full potential. I don't blame him. If you're not doing that with Thatch, you're not using him right, you know? Ooh, that weapon throws seal the deal. GG dude, GG. I would have liked to have seen at least a couple more cannonballs shooting out from Thatch, but you know, it's all good. Whenever I use Thatch, I, 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 I'm not gonna lie, I spam the cannon down sig, okay? If, you, <laughs> if I'm using Thatch, I'm spamming the cannonballs, I'm sorry, that's just how I play. Alright, uh, let's see. We've used pretty much all my favorite uh, uh, Koji, Koji skins. Sorry, I can't even talk right now. But I do like Demon Ogre Koji, and I do like Ronin Koji. Let's do Ronin. And I think I'll go black on the Ronin Koji. But let's give him a different looking bow and sword just to, to play things up. Oops. Let's see. Oh, that, that bow looks sick. New best friend. It'll, ma it'll match the black color scheme really well. And then let's give him the Sword of Heroes from Tigris. The Kung Fu Panda Azuri crossover. Check out this sword. So cool. By the way, guys, if you enjoyed this kind of content, please go ahead and drop a like. It really helps me out, and I appreciate it. Be sure to subscribe for more Brawlhalla content as well. I'm always putting it out there. A little bit of Rocket League dashed in as well. I love Rocket League. I just got Grand Champ in Rocket League for the first time, so I'm pretty excited about that. Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. All right, let's go. What? The zero to death that fast? All right. And that's how you zero to death with a bow. Honestly, Koji Sigs are basic, but if you're good at reading your opponent, they can be devastating. Like, because the hitboxes on them are so good. Like, these ones just go so far out, and then the down sig hits way bigger than most people anticipate, you know what I mean? And if you find somebody that likes to spot dodge straight down, they are going to have a bad day with going against Koji because Koji straight down, spot dodge, he'll just neutral sig every time. Oh man. I think she just like KO'd herself there, but GG dude, dude at GG, 75, oh my gosh, GG dude, GG. Hey, we all have those games, nothing against him, we all have those kind of games. All right, I'm going to do one more. This one's going to be Demon Ogre Koji. This is going to be the last one I do, and we're going Charged OG, baby. And I actually do like his default weapons on this one, so we're going to do default for now. I hope you guys enjoy the Koji gameplay as much as I enjoy recording it, because ah, when I play a legend that I haven't played in a long time, it just feels good. Is that just me? I love playing every legend in the game so much. I don't think you guys understand how much I love this game. It's just so much fun to me. Like, yeah, I get my butt kicked sometimes. Sometimes I run into to, to people that are toxic to me. But I don't let it get to me. And you know what? 
it's all good. It, you know, if they want to be toxic right now, they're probably just at an age where they think it's cool to be toxic, you know? I'll admit, even when I was younger, like when I was a teenager, I thought it was cool to be toxic, but as I've gotten older, and especially as I've had my own kids, I, I don't want them to be like that really, so I, you know, I try to be a good role model, and I find myself having more fun this way. And I find myself making a lot more friends. When you're, <laughs> when you're not toxic to everybody, guess what? You'll make a lot of friends that you may actually really, really enjoy having that person as a friend, you know? Okay, Bow versus Bow is getting a little crazy here. We're gonna have to take Ember out. She only has like two or three defense. I mean, and that should have been a KO for me, but instead I missed that recovery. This is gonna be an easy KO for Ember if she's able to hit me even once. Oh, more worried about that weapon spawn than dodging the spike ball coming at you 100 miles an hour, Ember. Ooh, I should have dodged up. When she does that neutral sig after a neutral light, if you dodge down, you will get hit from that, for sure. Definitely, if you want advice, try to dodge a different direction, like, all the time. Like, whenever they hit you with those basic moves, just... Dodge, jump, move differently all the time. It helps because they won't be able to read what you're doing as, as Oh! That was sick. But yeah, they, they won't be able to read you as well, so. Almost got her with that. Ouch, ouchie, I don't like it. Oh man. Oh, she's too slow. Too slow. She she could have taken advantage there and maybe applied the pressure a little bit better. Kept me from getting up there, but... I, I mean, she had the right idea, basically. Just poor execution, but GG. Either way, GG, dude. Well played, and that's going to be it for Koji for today. I know I didn't get to use every skin, but let me know in the comments below which legend you would like me to play next. Like I said, I love playing all of them. And I hope you enjoyed the video. Please drop a like if you did. This is Lucian Sword. I hope to see you in the next one, guys. Take it easy.